On this video, I'm gonna share with you exactly how you can make $90,000 per year and sometimes even more on YouTube. What's up guys, Nick of Rapclis here. Welcome to today's video. As I just mentioned, I'm gonna be sharing with you a specific thing that you can be doing on YouTube to make over $90,000 a year. Lots of people are doing it and there's no reason that you can't do it too if you follow everything that I'll be sharing here on this video. So if you're interested in that, make sure and stick around all the way to the end of this video. Now, if you do end up enjoying this content, as per usual, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new. And if you like this stuff and you think there's someone else that can get some value out of this, make sure and share it with them. Think about one person that can get some value out of this and that would like to make $90,000 a year on YouTube. If you guys are excited about this, I do wanna let, like, give me, give me some love down below. Let me know that you guys are excited about this. I'd love to hear some of the engagement, see what's going on in your guys' mind. If this is stuff that you are interested in it or you guys are more interested in other topics, let me know what kind of topics you guys are interested in down below so I can know what kind of videos that you guys are really resonating with and I can continue to make them. But as you know on this channel, if you've been subscribed for any period of time, you know that we do kind of a combination of YouTube ads, paid advertising, as well as personal development, manifestation, and really just crushing your dreams and how do you live a more fulfilling, prosperous, abundant life. So if you're interested in that, again, make sure and subscribe to the channel if you're not already and share this with some other people if they, you think they can get some value out of this. But Without further ado, let's jump into this type of stuff because on the, you know, the last few videos we've been making is a little bit more on manifestation and I was traveling quite a bit. So it was a little bit of shaky iPhone video. So I decided that I wanted to make a more highly produced video for you guys and um, yeah, just really give you the goods here. So what am I talking about with $90,000 a year? And what, who are these people that are making $90,000 a year, $90,000 a year, sometimes even a lot more? Well, what it really comes down to is media buying. Now, I've never really talked about it specifically on this channel like this, so that's why I decided I wanted to make a video like this and explain this whole process. So, what the heck is media buying if you don't already know what exactly that is? So basically a media buyer is an advertiser. Simply put, is a person that buys media online, whether that's on Facebook, whether that's on uh, networks like Taboola or even YouTube, Google. Like anywhere there is people in a network that they're, 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 where they have an advertising platform, that's where you can be a media buyer. Now, basically, I am a media buyer, okay? And so I do it in a few different ways and I wanna explain it why, you know, the base salary is $90,000 for a good media buyer. And I'm explaining why that is and how it actually makes sense and how you can actually turn that into something that can really help you make a ton more money than that, okay? So a media buyer, basically uh, where a media buyer actually uh, does their services, where they actually are, you know, fulfilling for clients is is mostly in an agency. Okay, a lot of times there can be like freelance media buyers. There can yeah, you can have media buyers. You can be a media buyer in your own agency. Like um, there's a lot of things. But ultimately, one of the first places that a media buyer will start out where they're making this ninety thousand dollars a year plus commissions a lot of the time is at an agency. And that's what I decided to do several months back is an agency approached me asking if they would like me to be a media buyer for their team. And so um, I said yes. And I said yes for a few different reasons because one, as you guys know, on this particular channel, we talk about YouTube advertising all the time. I talk about how you can do it for your company. I talk about how you can become a media buyer. I, I talked about that a little bit, not in this particular terminology, but how you can do it for other uh, companies, how you can do it for your company, how you can start your own agency, how you can start uh, just doing it for other people, okay? So there's a lot of different ways you can do it, but again, the first starting point typically is with an agency. So that's what I did uh, when I was first kind of getting started out after I was having a lot of results for myself running my own campaigns, running for a few different client campaigns, and then I started working with this agency because they had a lot of clients and they wanted help with um, with buying media, optimizing, scaling, managing the ad accounts so that they could get a better ROI. And that's what really leads me to this next point. Why the heck would someone pay a media buyer $90,000 a year plus commission to buy their media, to run their ads? Why, that doesn't, how does that make sense? Well, it makes, it makes perfect sense because 
As a media buyer, that is a high income skill. One of my mentors always talked about this. There's a, a variety of high income skills, but you really want to adopt and master a high income skill. One of the high income skills is copywriting. One of the high income skills is speaking. One of the high income skills is closing, right? closing on the phones. Um, and not even on the phones, but just closing in general, closing sales. And then one of the other big high income skills is media buying. So why is this? All four of these, where I talked about copywriting, speaking, closing, and media buying. Why are those all high income skills? Why would someone pay you big money in order to do one of those? Well, ultimately because it helps make even more money. With a media buyer, if you are a good media buyer and you have the skills to buy media, typically what that is doing, if you're doing it correctly and you're working with the right clients, is that you're making the client a ton of money. And so, you know, typically within our agency, like I have an agency and I'm gonna get into that here in a second as well. But in the other agency, like always, we're looking to get at least, at least a 2x return, meaning we're spending, every time we spend a dollar, we're making $2 back. Sometimes we're even making three, four, five dollars at times. So you can see that like a good media buyer, someone knows that exactly what they're doing in terms of media buying, they can take a dollar and turn that into five dollars, four dollars, three dollars, somewhere around there. I mean, even if you're taking a dollar and turn that into two dollars, like how many times would you do that? If you had a machine where you just put a dollar in and every time you put a dollar in, two pop back out, that would be a pretty valuable skill. And you'd probably pay that person to start doing that for you. you. You pay them a percentage or you pay them a good fee to continue to put dollars in the machine and continue to feed it out and give you $2 every time you put a dollar in. I mean, just think about that. You put a dollar in, you make $2. You put a thousand dollars in, you make $2,000. You put a hundred thousand dollars in, you make $200,000. It makes sense. That is a high income skill. And if you can do that and you are consistent with it and you truly know that you have, have the ability to do that, you have the ability to charge a lot of money. And the first place that I would recommend you starting out is at an agency. So I would start out like reaching out to agencies, start working on your craft, start listening to this YouTube channel a little bit more, learning a little bit more about YouTube ads, how you can get better at them. Uh, there's a lot of other resources. I have a coaching program as well that I'm about to release. I have different products and services. So you can learn it from me, but it's not only just me, like there's a ton of other people that are teaching this type of stuff. So learn the skills. That's what I did in the beginning. I was learning the skills, then I started applying them to my campaigns, and then I started generating a few clients, started applying it to their campaigns, and I started uh, kind of developing my own strategy. I call it the MCP formula. And I'm actually gonna put together a free video case study that shows exactly how that is. So if you guys are interested in learning more about the MCP formula specific to YouTube ads, uh, put an MCP down below and I'll once we do have that ready, I'll get it out to you. But I digress. Uh, the reason that I'm sharing that is because that's just kind of the starting point. You're making 90K a year plus commissions a lot of time if you're getting really good and you're really making the client a lot of money. But what you also can do is if you want and you wanna scale it up and you wanna make even more money and you wanna have bigger impact, you can start your own agency. Or you can just, you don't even, it has to, doesn't have to necessarily be an agency, it can just be you're working with a few clients. And that's what I'm really doing. Like an agency, a lot of the agencies, they, they go big. Okay, they work with tons of clients and then therefore they're hiring a bunch of media buyers. That's not necessarily what I do. Okay. I just have a core group of clients, you know, anywhere from like four to six clients, usually three, probably three to six, um, where I'm fully invested in them. They're fully invested in me. We have an amazing relationship and we work extremely hard and make them a lot of money. Okay. I'm not too bit, I'm not too worried about getting like 20, 30, 40, 50 clients and hiring a huge team of media buyers and a huge team of everything else that com comes with an agency. I rather work hard with certain people, get them crazy returns, and then just focus on my coaching program and all that kind of stuff. So there's a lot of different ways on how you, like, you can start as a media buyer making 90K a month if you are good. Okay, again, that depends on if you're good. Not every media buyer is good, so it's important to continually educate yourself, invest in yourself, and level up in your education so that you can apply it better. But once you are there making $90,000 a month, excuse me, not 90, not 90K a month, 90K a year, plus commissions if you're really good, but then you can start expanding and getting your own clients, start working that, and start hiring your own media buyers if that's something you wanna do. And that's kind of why I decided I wanted to make this video because I'm, I'm slowly starting to get in the, into the process of hiring my own media buyers. And that's also why I'm starting my coaching program is because 
I want to teach people how to do this type of stuff because it's very valuable and I want to continue to teach people. I have a real passion for teaching people, but it also is a little selfish because basically I'm starting this coaching program because I want to start grooming the best, the best media buyers that I can start hiring for my boutique agency where we can really crush it, where I'm just kind of more so the CEO managing things. And I just have my, my team of A-list a media buyers that are crushing it for my clients and therefore I can pay them somewhere around 90K a year because they're crushing it for our clients and we're doing amazing. So that's why um, I'm kind of starting this coaching program as well as grooming some media buyers because I want them on my team to really uh, perform and kill it for my clients. So um, if you guys are interested in any of that, put a comment down below, just put an interested or media buying or agency or just put something down below. Let me know you are interested. Um, this, this is going to be kind of a gradual process. I'm not saying that I have a spot open right now for a good media buyer, but it's going to happen eventually down the road. And again, that's kind of why I decided to make this video, but I also wanted to educate you guys on why you'd want to be a media buyer first and foremost. And there's a lot of different agencies out there and it doesn't even, you don't have to be particular to YouTube either. It can be on Facebook, it could be on Taboola, it could be on Bing if you wanted to go that route. Like anywhere there is a advertising network on any of these on different platforms that you could be a media buyer on any of those. And I recommend that you get specific on one particular platform because um, it can be a lot if you try to tackle more. But I'm just saying like, there's tons and tons of Facebook ad, ad agencies where they're looking for quality media buyers. Even I have a friend that's, he's actually actively looking for a Facebook media buyer right now. That's really good, that can help, you know, really deliver for his clients. So I'm just saying that there's a huge opportunity out there, it doesn't matter which network it is, pick a network and decide you're gonna be a media buyer and start getting really good at it, start educating yourself, start researching it, even if it's just YouTube. That's how I really started. I started looking at all the guys that are doing really good on, on YouTube ads, I started finding their YouTube channels and I started learning. And then I started investing in courses. Then I started investing into coaching. Then I got hired by the media agency and then I started running, uh, I started being a media buyer for them and that really helped because I was spending a lot of money and anywhere from like $100,000 a month to up to $250,000 a month where we managed that and seeing it in real time data, what's working, what's not working. So you can kind of see the progression of like starting from just watching YouTube videos to actually managing hundreds of thousands of dollars a month. Like it can really help you elevate and educate yourself. And once you're really good, you can, you know, like people will pay like $90,000 a year because of the fact that you're bringing that much value to their agency. And then again, you can start scaling up from there, getting your own clients, put together coaching programs, like really becoming a master at this and, and teaching people. And you get paid for specialized knowledge as we talk about uh, a lot on different videos. We talked about that on this video here. So that's the rundown guys. Hopefully you enjoyed that information. Let me know if you have any questions about that. I know that this is kind of an, uh, a complex topic to a degree. So if you guys do have any questions, put them down in the comments below. But I wanted to make that video for you, give you guys some value, help you understand how there is a lot of opportunity online. And again, it doesn't mean you have to just go with YouTube or you just go with Facebook, but there's, there's so many different options. There's people that have agencies for local businesses. There's people that have agencies for coaching and course creators. There's uh, service provider agencies. So there's so much opportunity out there. It's just about putting your name out there and getting good at something so that you can actually deliver a lot of value. So wanted to share that with you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy that kind of stuff. Let me know down below what you got most out of this video. And if you'd like me to make a part two, if you have any questions, I'd love to share some more with you. But again, subscribe to the channel if you want to learn more about this media buying, uh, advertising as a whole and uh, personal development and really manifestation and really just living your best life so you can live more prosperous, more fulfilled, you have more freedom and you're just have, living an abundant life. So if you guys are down with that, make sure to subscribe and share this with a few friends. But thank you for watching the video and we'll see you on the next one. Tonight.